Chris. I go to Fort Meade Middle Senior High and I'm 12 years old. And my family, they, they're into CrossFit, which does, has to do a lot with weightlifting, and so I came from a weightlifting background. This is my first year weightlifting, but I've kind of always watched weightlifting since my parents have been involved with CrossFit for a while. First, at first I thought that, I mean, since my parents are doing it, maybe I should do it too, just to be with my parents more, but I think that it's become a like kind of like something that I have I like to do more every day and so it's just like something I enjoy now. Uh, Emma she came for tryouts. Uh, we held the open tryout for the girls weightlifting team and she came out and she definitely impressed. Uh, we just wanted to see what type of technique that the girls possess and she by far was one of the better lifters that I had on the team. The thing I love the most about weightlifting is that I get encouraged to do it and people encourage me and I, I like the rush and I like to be competitive. When you're by yourself in a, in a kind of sport, in other sports you're, you're with a team and so when you're by yourself it's like all the pressure's on you and I kind of like that. I think one of my biggest weaknesses are when I'm going into a meet and I see a lot of strong, strong girls and they all, they all lift a lot and I think I get discouraged and I think that I can't lift more than them. I, overall, I can, I, I know I can do it, I know I can do it and I'll tell myself that you can do, the, you can do this, you can do this. Uh, she's lifting, if not the same, more than the girls that's three and four years older than her. Given her stature, and her strength and ability at this young age, this, I mean, I, I don't see a limit for her. You know, I was, could say the sky's the limit, but I don't see a ceiling for her. I mean, she is just off the charts and I could definitely see her being able to fulfill her dream uh, by being a, a USA weightlifter. Um, after school, I come here to the weight room and I, I do our normal routine of weightlifting and then after usually I'll go to dance and then after dance I'll go to CrossFit and then I'll go home. What do we do? Um, we do bench press and we do clean and jerk. I prefer clean and jerk. I, I enjoy clean and jerk more. I guess sometimes it's harder but I think that when it's harder it's, it challenges you more and I think that that's a good thing. Um, on bench press, my, the highest I've got is 80, and on clean and jerk, I've got 85. I stress doing the best that you can do. Uh, be the best that you can be with the person that you are. You know, get the most out of yourself, and that's, what, that's our approach to every meet. We don't focus on the weights that the other girls are lifting. Our focus is what you're capable of doing. So if your best is 85, we're going for 90 today. You know, so we want to maximize our potential as, you know, as a team. I hope to go farther in weightlifting, maybe USA weightlifting. Yeah, there are some times that I just get overwhelmed with weightlifting and I just want to quit. But I just, my dad and my coaches, and they all just encourage me to keep going, keep going. So you should get involved in weightlifting because it's fun to compete and even though you you might not place or anything, it's, it's fun and it, it really gives you a rush. All right.